Hello everybody, Mr. Rome here. Welcome back to Transport Fever 2. In the last episode, we worked on setting things up, setting things up so that machines will get delivered to Elverum and to Kongsberg here. And you know, that involved kind of getting various road transport lines set up, making an adjustment to one of our Uh, freight stations here, adding in some adjusted track, which I hope don't cause any problems, but we'll have to keep an eye on it. I think it was going to have to get reworked at some point. This whole area is going to have to get reworked. We had another major traffic jam up here in this region, which is going to have to get reworked as well. So, yeah. I'm going to rip that oil well out. I'm going to have to rethink some stuff. So, Probably do some more bypass uh, track in certain areas. That sort of thing. So, after all of that got dealt with, which ended up taking a lot more time than I had anticipated that it would, we finally got to working on our first new freight line in the Southern Hills area of the map which is to connect this quarry here to this construction materials plant while going through or near this silver mine. And this is also going to be our first electrified rail line. Intentionally electrified rail mine, a rail line. And so that is going to deliver stone, and then we're going to deliver the construction materials from this factory into Narvik. So now that we have the rail in, we need to get a train on that line. So what we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and put a... We're just going to use one of the small standard uh, depots. There, I was that, that word was eluding me. Um, we were doing what, 140 or 180? What was the speed that I was using? And I'm 180. Okay, yeah, that's. I mean, we're sticking with single track for now. We'll probably make it double um, eventually. But since it's going to be single track with only one train on it, we're not going to worry about signals or anything yet. So let's get that going. Oh, we're going to need a line to put this on. This is going to be train freight. Uh, this is going to be Falloon Stone. That's where it's coming from. All right. Okay, so let's unpause it for a minute. Just gonna have to keep an eye on things. Make sure we're not going negative on the rail. All right, so we want to go with electric locomotive. Now this guy is gonna be the best one. Though this AE-47 is kind of in a nice spot in between the crocodile. 150 kilonewtons. And this, just look at that attractive effort.
Um, it might be worth it. All right, let's let's try. Let's let's throw the big boy on there. No, this is not the big boy. This is the the larger locomotive <laughs> on there. It does what 120 kilometers per hour. There's a, it's gonna do that speed. Um, uh, top speed. I need. See, this is a 120 kilometer per hour open wagon. That'll do it. Let's have it have 150 capacity. 23 million. Yeesh. Do it. All right. I'm able to find path to stop missing electric tracks. Really? Did I not put... Hold on. Yeah, somehow I managed to get a stretch of that track. Or all that track that doesn't have electric on it. Silly me. Alright. There we go. could absolutely haul a lot more than that. Twice as much as that. Then do so. All right, we're gonna add the selected vehicle. Give me 300 capacity. That'll still be good. 270 capacity. 270 capacity. We aren't speed limited here at all, right? Is that just because of the slope? Yeah. I think that's just because of the slope. Now, we don't have anybody up here that is demanding construction materials, right? No. We actually have very few cities that are demanding construction materials at all. Hopefully somebody does. All right, now, all we're gonna need to do is set up a delivery point. Actually, what we're probably gonna do is we're gonna, uh, construction materials is the only thing that's coming through here. Set up a delivery point. We need to do it in Narvik, and it needs to be somewhere. Uh, and that should cover most of the industry. Perfect. 
Now, you need tram. Done. Actually, let's throw tram all the way down there. Probably want to upgrade that street. Yeah, okay. From there to there. Narvik deliveries. For now, that's what it is. Uh, and we're going to need... Where is our... Tram Depot. There it is. Cargo trams. The Georges. They're going to need to be flatbeds. Or steak cars. Let's get a couple of 2x trams. That'll be enough to get started. And almost certainly we're gonna need to do more than that. I'm just I was just looking at this and going we should have a roof on this station We'll go with that. So, are you coming down with any stone? You are coming down with a little tiny bit of stone. Hopefully, we get more than that. Because there's no way this train is ever going to make any money. It's screaming downhill at 120 kilometers an hour. Because if we can't fill this train... And there's no point to making it that big. So we would have to probably swap down to a smaller locomotive and less cars. So we will have to see. Up to 17. All right. So next thing that we're going to want. We have a machines factory right there. 
They want silver bars and steel. Now, we have a silver mine right there, but I don't see... I have another silver ore mine over there. Here's a machines factory that wants silver. But I do not... There's a silver mill, but it's way over there. I don't see a silver mill anywhere nearby. Okay. Well then, let's destroy something we're not going to need and replace it with a silver mill. That's the way I want to handle it, is if I want to put something in custom, I've got to destroy... Oh, there's a silver mill. Never mind. Well, isn't that perfect? All right. Um... Well, that means we're probably going to have to double track this, which is fine. Here's the thing is that in order to bypass this, we're going to need to double track on this side. And on the bypass this, we're going to double track on that side. We're going to have to, have to rework that connection. All right. How much is it going to pick up? It's going to pick up 37. 38. 40? Forty is not gonna be anywhere near enough. Alright, well we'll let it sit there and run for a little bit and then we'll see where it what it ends up at. Okay. Let's actually slow things down a little bit. Same thing over here. We're going to configure this. All right, actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to speed this up. Pause it with this train in the station. Nine hundred K. Narvik now wants fuel. Really? Well, we can probably accommodate that at some point, but for now, not so much. All right. What I want is for this train to end up on the right side of the track when we do this. All right, so this is going to need to get kind of severed a little bit. Not a problem. that down there good deal but signals wrong signals
Actually, uh, hold on. We need to rework this. There it is. Okay. All right. So there we are. All right. And then from here... Murdered down real quick right there. All right, so that should work. So now that stone line. Yeah, that's actually fine, because we have a train waiting there. We'll wait for this guy to get over there, and then it's going to go straight through there. Actually, yeah, it'll, it'll work. I'm pretty sure it'll work. I want to let this thing go through a couple more cycles. It's actually going to be up to 40 already. It might. It might ramp up enough. Now that we're actually starting to deliver and then this thing is starting to fire up and say, hey, I want, I want more. I want more. All right. So now over here, you're going to swing through here. We're gonna need is cargo high speed for the moment it's gonna be a single track I would probably have to remove that. Yeah, that's in the way. This road is almost certainly going to cause problems, so we'll tear that out too. Actually, I should have added more tracks, but that's okay. That's what we'll do. Is I'll pre-build the bypass track. With the expectation that we might we might need them. It's, it's, it's kind of chugging down a little bit. It's all right. That bit of road's probably going to have to get torn out. Oh, that's road. Uh, that's not what we want. Signals in the tunnel. I don't like to do that, but 
We're gonna do that. All right. So that should work. Okay. Uh, new bus. Uso B46. All right. So now what we're going to want is we're going to want a line from here. Ooh, it's not actually connected to anything. Aha. Yes. Construction not possible. What do you mean construction not possible? Construction is possible. Definitely does does not want to do it on that curve. Okay, then is it because of the signal? Hold on, turn out the signal. do it now yep it'll do it now it was a signal all right excellent so now what we can do is we can go to line one manage the line at a station there this is gonna be train freight Falloon Silver. All right. Oh, we need to reconnect this. Just gonna slide up here a little bit and then just merge into that track. Should be fine, just isolate it off with a signal. Shouldn't cause any trouble. See, that's the thing. If we are going to put this on there, we need trains that are all going to be the same relative speed. Yeah, there's no way this thing is going to this is this thing is going to work. All right. So, what we're going to do is we're going to modify that train, manage the vehicle, edit it, get rid of that locomotive. We're gonna knock this down to, let's see, about 140 capacity, maybe? Let's see, if we throw that on there, it says good. What if we throw the crocodile on there? 75 kilometers an hour. Because it is the cheapest. You know what? Let's try it. Let's see what it does. Make sure it's painted properly. There we go. Oh my goodness, we have two heads on there. Ooh, we do not want that to be double-headed. No thank you. Oh, and I just accidentally cloned it. No. 
we want to edit it we want to take that off of there there we go now is it still good it is still good okay Yep, it's, it's hitting its speed. Okay, so let's do the same thing. Basically, let's let's actually let's go ahead and clone it. But we're gonna take this train that we just cloned and we're gonna move it to the silver line. Done. Yep, it's hitting his speed going uphill. I'm gonna be 40 there. How much? The silver is going to have a lot more. All right. Now, we would need to figure out how to get the silver to the machines factory. It's trying to get from like using this rail line is going to be somewhat difficult. All right, cuz and I could do something like this. Which is not entirely impossible. But it's going to be very hard for that to make any kind of money. Hmm. Place these with the larger ones and clone them. Done. You know, that's almost half full. Where's the other train? There it is. Balloon one's construction material. I think we're actually at the end of this. Oh, that made a profit. Excellent. One, seven million. Arstad is now one's construction material. Even better. That means we can now dis distribute more construction material. Um, we have another quarry anywhere? We have another quarry there. Let's see what we can do with this one.
All right, we're going to go ahead and stop here for now. And we'll work on figuring out how to get that silver to the uh, machines factory and also set up the distribution of the construction materials in the Harstad. Possibly even Falun there uh, for next episode. Um, you actually made profit, but you have a little bit of a hole to dig out of. All right, but we'll stop here and work on that later. So for now, hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.